Hey, what's up guys? I'm Tiger with Tiger Pro Media back with another Dokkan battle video. So last night, we had this long ass maintenance on Global, right? I think it was extended by at least like five to six hours. And then when we were able to finally log into the game, we were greeted by this absolutely massive data download of at least 430 megabytes, 260 plus assets. And I got curious, I was like, what is this data download about? Because the in-game news doesn't really tell us much, right? It tells us about the new update with some optimization, which actually makes us, makes a huge difference. By the way, guys, if you go into the game right now, run a stage, everything runs so much smoother, so much quicker, just so much snappier. Like, it's perfect. Awesome, awesome update for that. I love it. Um, and also, of course, some bug fixes, some, some minor stuff, but that doesn't really account for the 430 plus megabytes that we got. So I did some digging around, did some research, and I found this post by uh, data miner Dokkan Air on Twitter. So all credit for the info in this video goes to him. And he just basically did this big data dump of all the assets that were added to Global. And uh, I'll show you guys real quick. So there are three pictures. This is the first one. And as you can see, the answer to the question, what was added to Global with the data download, is basically everything, <laughs> a whole bunch of crap. As you can see, there are some assets for the uh, tech transforming trunks over here, some trunks heads. We got this um, freezer right here, which is actually the SSR art for the LR full power Frieza. Here's his, SS, uh, his LR art actually. Um, there is the uh, tech Khalifla, the STR Kale that are coming with the LR Kale and Khalifla. There is um, some awakenings for certain cards. Uh, there is the awakening for the Mai right there, the Int Mai, that also comes with the Tomasu and Trunks um, Dual Dokkan Fest. Yo, so much stuff going through my head right now. Can't even talk. Um, what else? There was Gowasu on the other page I think I missed. Uh, over here, Gowasu right here, Gowasu and Tomasu. Um, some effects for these various cards. And uh, what else? We got LR Kale and Khalifla right here, as you guys can see. I'm sorry if it's so small, but I'm sure you guys can still tell, like, relatively that, like, like what these things are. We got the transforming Namek Goku right here. Um, what, what, do we, what else do we have? Just, just so much stuff, man. Just like basically everything. Everything that Global is missing right now. Oh, we have the STR Gogeta, the base form Gogeta that is, that we're still missing from the Broly story event. Um, uh, LR, uh, King Cold, and Mecha Frieza at the bottom here. Uh, the Extreme Z Awakenable uh, physical second form Frieza. And, uh, I mean, you guys can take a look. Like, there's so much stuff to point out. I can't really, you know, label every single thing on this page. But the point I'm trying to make is the reason the data download is so big is because they just added basically everything from JP that Global was missing. And if you're like me and you were just really curious about what's going on with the data download, here's your answer. But before we get super excited, let me be clear, all right? Just because these things were added to the database on Global does not mean they're coming out anytime soon, all right? This is something, this is a practice that they've done in the past many times where they add assets in advance, but keep them inactive, all right? Until they're ready to be released. So as Dokkan Air says here at the bottom, excluding STR Goku Black, which is the next uh, world tournament reward for this upcoming world tournament on Global, the STR SSJ Goku of the World Tournament, the Int Yardrat Goku, and also the STR Android 18 Awakening. Excluding those four characters, the rest of the characters that you saw in this data dump are inactive and there's no guarantee for when they will come out. Like eventually, of course, they will all be released, but I think the Trunks and Zamasu Dual Dokkan Fest is honestly still quite a ways away, maybe um, I'd say two, three, four months away. Maybe at the end of this year we'll get it. And, uh, you know, Namek Goku could be next, but nobody really knows. So nothing is guaranteed. Who knows when Kale and Khalifa are going to come out. They're just adding them to the database right now uh, in advance because they, they feel like it to get ready for their releases in the future, right? And something that I thought was pretty funny is this comment down here uh, that says, Ah, this basically confirms that the next Dokkan Fest is STR Goku. Nice. And... The truth below him is like, it doesn't confirm anything, which is absolutely true, guys. This confirms nothing, all right? The only purpose um, for this video that I made was to let you guys know that we got a massive data download because of that stuff. I don't want people to get too hyped, though. All right, I want to keep expectations 
very under control. Um, we got all this stuff that we're eventually going to get in the future that JP has already gotten, but we don't know when any of it is going to come out. Um, of the things that aren't shown here, that aren't featured here in these pictures, uh, we also got the basically loading screens for the countdown celebration for the 300 million downloads celebration, right? So the countdown starts on August 20th and every single day we're going to get one new loading screen with, you know, one day lower with a different character on it, basically leading up to the 300 million download celebration, very similar to what we got for the four year anniversary. So we got that to look forward to. And also the wallpaper feature was also added to the game, but we can't really do anything with it yet, but I do expect that we'll get some wallpapers uh, to swap out our home screen with once the celebration actually starts. And um, of course, we also got our uh, live stream stones, so people will be asking for about that. Uh, there you go guys, we got, finally got our 50 stones from the live stream as well as 4 extra for the long maintenance, which I'm totally okay with. Oh, before I forget, one other thing that was added to the database that is very, very important is of course the 300 million downloads tickets, which we'll all be getting once the celebration officially begins. So uh, that's pretty much it guys, we got a lot of assets, just a ton of crap, that's why the download was so big. Um, but like I said, one more time, not like we don't know when any of this stuff is going to drop, so don't get too excited right now. Um, and hopefully this video was uh, enlightening or informative for you guys, and if it was, then make sure, as always, to like the damn video, and if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now, and while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it, that's all I gotta say, hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.